Jersey Sports Zone's coverage of Donovan Catholic is being brought to you by Georgian Court University. A much anticipated softball showdown in Red Bank, Donovan Catholic is the two time defending Shore Conference champ. St. John Vianney, a perfect 22 0, ranked number one in the state. This game met the hype and then some. The Griffins set the tone at the top of the first. Julia Apostolaco smacks a base hit up the middle. Jenna Giatino scores. The Griffins pitcher helps herself out early. It's 1 0 Donovan Catholic. Apostolakis was locked in right from the get go on the hill. She starts a special night with an early strikeout. In the third, who else? Apostolakos delivers again at the plate. This ground out is able to score Giatino. Donovan Catholic with a 2-0 lead. The Griffins ace was able to tame a lineup that averages 11.8 runs per game. Julia Apostolakos strikes out the side in the fourth and the fifth. She's perfect through five innings. Top six, Donovan Catholic looking for more. But Holly Lovett makes a sensational catch at third on the laser. That is a big time play by the Lancer senior. Take another look. You see why they call it the hot corner. Holly Lovett takes away extra bases with the web gem. After 16 up and 16 down, SJV works a pair of walks in the bottom of the six. Madison McDougal slices one to left. It's fair and off the fence. Two runs come in to score. The Lancers' first hit of the game was a huge one. A two-run double for the freshman, and we're tied up at two. McDougal was outstanding on the hill. The freshman shined in a high-stakes game. The Lancers with a chance to walk it off in the bottom of the seventh. Apostolaco settled down after losing the perfect game. Yet another strikeout. She's in double digits, and we've got extra innings in the short conference championship. After a scoreless eighth, the Griffins have two on in the ninth. Isabel Catalona makes the catch on the bunt. The throw to first goes into right field. Jordan Gautier comes up gunning. The throw to third is in time. Out is the call. A 3-9-5 double play. Donovan Catholic thinks the tag was missed, but the call stands. But the Griffins recover. Next batter, Gia Gordon. The sophomore delivers a huge base hit up the middle. Donovan Catholic has the lead. It's 3-2, DC, three outs away from the title. Bottom nine, St. John Vianney won't go away. Elizabeth Gigliolino with a base hit to right. Kelly Plumaker is flying around the bases. The throw from right goes wild. Plumaker scores all the way from first. We're tied at three, and SJV's got the winning run in scoring position. Here's Gautier hitting it hard to center. Giatino makes the catch. Fires to second for the double play. Man, oh man, nine innings can't settle this one. We go to the 10th in an epic title game. Both teams get a runner on second from here on out. Freshman Isabella Maria hits a bloop to right and it drops. Maria comes through with the RBI single and Donovan Catholic has the lead again. It's four to three. Vianney bunts the tying run to third in the bottom of the 10th, but Apostolakos bears down. This is her 16th strikeout of the game. Another incredible performance by the senior. And the marathon comes to an end with this pop out to second. Donovan Catholic is the short conference softball champ for a third straight year in one of the best games of the year on the softball diamond. Four to three is your final in 10 innings. We could see these two teams again in the state playoffs. The Griffins knew this game had a state championship feel. It was, it was crazy, um, anxious, but um, just kept remembering the Bible quotes, if God is within her, she will not fail. And I knew that, and God is within all of us, and we did not fail, and we just kept fighting with our hearts. It was like probably one of the most exciting games I've played in, and it was very like nerve-wracking, but I mean, they were a great team. I feel relieved, I definitely feel relieved, but um, I'm just happy to get to play with this team, and we're gonna keep succeeding. In Red Bank, I'm Rich Crampanis for JerseySportsZone.com.